Good morning and welcome to the start of our How Gills Walk. We're about to do day one of our little adventure in which we're going up Archer Hill and uh, thanks to Terry who's with us we're going to also do Old Dow Head which was down for another walk but we're going to nip it off because of his experience he says it'll avoid us a high climb and I'm all for that. Diddy Dave, the lovely Claire and Terry well we're going to take you along with us hope you enjoy the ride Obviously, we would have preferred to complete the Howgill Fells as per Wainwright's book, but living so far away in Southend on Sea in Essex, sadly it was just not feasible for us to do his 25 walks over these lovely green giants. For our first adventure in this new area for us, we had a nice, easy, pleasant six mile walk planned, taking in the fells covered in chapters 12, 13 and 14. Starting from Carlingill Bridge, we head up the path that runs above and parallel with Weasel Gill, keeping Carlingill Beck to our right. Arriving at the base of Archer Moss, we head southwest to Ulgill Head. Then, turning north, we walk over an easy grass path to Risper Pike. Returning for a while by the same path, we turn westwards and then north to Archer Hill and its lovely tarn. We then walk along another arc and we drop onto boggy ground to ascend to Hare Shore. Following a clear path for a while which ends over peat bog, we make for Bleasfell. From here we get great views over the M6 to the Windfell Ridge in the west and to Fell Head and the Calf in the south. We then descend alongside Grainsgill back to the car at Carlingill Bridge. bit of bracken. It is June of course, so uh, to be expected. Hopefully not too much once we get up a bit. Beautiful already. Really enjoying this already. Lovely warm day. There was a few midges early doors. Seem to have gone. Need a bit of a breeze, really. Anyway, crack on. It was really wonderful to be joined by Claire again. Her first real walk since damaging her knee on a skiing holiday. And Terry Holden, who has joined the group and used this walk to meet a few of the team. Only time will tell if we've put him off walking with us again. Viewpoint on Old Dow Head. Very nice it is too.
you're walking the How Girls. What ones have you done? You said you've done a few. Oh, right, yeah. The car. Oh, the, oh, you've done the car? Yeah, yeah. All round. I used to live in Sadler. Ah. So all the ones sort of walk up on the Sadler side have been up. All oh, right, so... Well, years ago, we used to walk with a friend who was a mountain rescue. He was training. So he would drag us up there in all kinds of different ways. Oh, right. So I have no idea, actually, what tops I've been on. <laughs> But well, no, you, you knew you'd done your calf anyway. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's the highest one, yeah, so yeah. that's all you really needed to know, yeah. really, wasn't it? Yeah. Oh, that's good. It looks like there's a shelter or something on top of it. Yeah. Not scheduled, nor was old our head. But we're cracking them off to give us an easier day another day. Very nice Mal it is to. Hey? Now he's just coming on a short walk. Hey? Is that You've been on many fat boys walks. You know they always turn oh. into walking over rough ground and we've got no idea where we're going. <laughs> I don't know why you're surprised. <laughs> peaceful place to take a break as you can see, just the sound of the skylarks. Wainwright says of the How Girls, their greatest appeal must ever be to those who love to walk freely over the tops and commune with nature in solitude. There is no better place for doing this than in the How Girl Fells. Bless them.
One night of magic rush, the star a simple touch. One night to push and scream, and then breathe. Ten days of perfect tunes, the colors red and blue. We had a promise made. We were in love. We called for Wainwright, as always, was spot on when saying, these are unlike the craggy mountains of Lakeland, but steep-sided gentle domes that from a distance look like velvet curtains in the sunlight. This for us was a small start to a very enjoyable larger adventure in which we make the great man's insightful words become a reality. Please check out the other videos on our YouTube website, all 214 Wainwrights captured in video, as well as the outlying fells and various other walks. Thank you for viewing our videos, we really appreciate it. And don't forget to subscribe so you get priority viewing in future. As always, hopefully one day, we'll see you out there. Thanks for watching. Cheers.